All right, folks, so we are in the heart of Bowser's Castle right now. Last stream, we actually made it here. We've cleared about a third of it, so we have two thirds of the castle left, maybe a little bit less, and then we might actually be able to clear the entire main story tonight. If so, it will probably be a longer stream than usual, but that's okay. I'm prepared for that. Bowser's Shop. Wow, they actually sell Ultra Shrooms and Jam and Jellies now. What? Who are you, man? I don't know your face. Maybe you're Mario, huh? <laughs> just joking. I'm the guard of this warehouse. I'm really, really bored, man. Hey, you know, if you got any coins, I'll sell you stuff. Oh, you're voted, man! Take a look around, I'll sell you anything you see. Wow, those are cheap! Compared to Thousand Year Door prices. I like that. I like that they actually sell Ultra Shrooms and Jam and Jellies here. That's really cool. Take my shooting star... Don't tell King Bowser about any of this. Oh, I wouldn't dream of it. Oh, I want the pebble. I want to finish off Bowser with a pebble. If possible. I probably won't. I'll probably realistically throw the pebble away. But that's okay. I suppose we're at the point where I don't need to attack every enemy that I see. It would just be fun to do so. Oh yeah, I haven't tattled on the Magic Koopas yet. That's that's a little bit of an issue. Dog on it. I hate it that they can be transparent for no reason. All right. Well, let's take out the Koopa Trolls first. Because they can hypercharge. Do not trans... You sack... Of mud. Wait, I, I don't have Zap Tap equipped. Why did I do that? <laughs> I'm happy, though. Uh-oh, that was not enough to finish him. At least he didn't go hyper. I do not like how they keep boosting that guy's defense, though. He's still not dead, are you serious? How much HP do these Magic Koopas have? Too much. Thank you for not hypercharging. Ouch! Alright, well, I want to see how much HP these guys have. I thought I already tattled on the Magic Koopas much earlier in the game. I guess the Magic Koopa you fight against Twink is not the same as the Magic Koopas here. Alright, take that. I'm happy. Alright. Just because I don't know how much defense this guy has, we're gonna Power Quake him. Okay, well, we took a whole lot of damage there. That's not very fun. Oh, hi. <laughs> oh, hi! And we can tattle on the bony beetles. <sighs> I think I need HP more than anything else. I'm afraid I'm gonna die if I don't smooch. <laughs> I'm happy with the kiss. Alright, nice. Excellent. Okay, attack power plus two. Fun. And there we go. What are they doing? I forgot they could do that. Okay, well... This looks like a job for Power Quake. I'm happy. And now what I think we're gonna do... I think it's time to squirt. Squirt the guy who's electric. 
Oh man, that doesn't quite kill! That's bad. Ouch. That's also real bad. Thankfully, we have Power Quake to get us out of this jam. Oh, I don't think we've used Sushi's Belly Flop yet. It's very meh. Not great, not terrible. Well, shoot, we are running real low on HP. Actually, nah, I'll fight the Magic Koopa. Okay, well, actually, maybe we won't fight the Magic Koopa. Wow, what? Why? If we run away and we fail, then we're dead. We can't use up and away, either. Hmm. <laughs> Alright, yeah, we're not fighting that guy. Ah, uh, yes! I like this set of rooms. The sushi rooms. These are fun. Very creative. Good use of sushi as a party member. I'm glad that the, the game kind of makes you use all of your party members in Bowser's Castle to make them all shine. It's a, it's very nice. I know Goombario doesn't get to get used, because his overworld ability has no utility purpose. I also can't remember if Cooper gets used, either. Actually, we might not be able to get to the end of the game this stream, but I think we can at the very least get to the end of Bowser's Castle. Because I forgot about the bombshell bill rooms that are coming up relatively soon, actually. And the Dry Bones uh, rooms. And of course, we also have Junior Troopa to fight. Castle Key! Lovely. I love the sound effect it makes when it's draining the water. Very nice. <laughs> Boin. All right, Sushi. Take us home. Should I go back and save? Because I really don't want to have to fight those enemies again. And Mario is kind of dangerously low on HP. I know it's probably supposed to be a toilet flushing sound, but I really like that sound. I wish that the toilet at my house actually sounded like that. Alright. What badges do I have equipped? Hmm. I feel like I need the extra defense in here. Oh, I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to unequip these, and I'm going to equip uh, Zap Tap. Because I'm getting sick of those Magic Koopas who are electrified that I can't really do anything about. Okay, nope, I'm going back and saving. I do not want to have to do the Sushi Room again, nor do I want to face the enemies again, and I have, I'm i pretty sure I'm going to end up dying to those Bombshell Bills, because I think they're going to deal like 30 damage a piece or something. And they're going to be launched super fast, much like the bullet bills. 
I'm also going to take a nap. Not in real life, but... If I know Pro Mode, and I know Pro Mode fairly well now... It's better safe than sorry. Oh yeah, we have to talk to the Toad to sleep. Do 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 do. Good night. I guess whether I beat the game tonight or not depends on how uh, how much trouble the, these enemies give me. All right, let's get Gumbario ready. Evening, Janae. How are you doing? Nice to see ya. Oh, I think I'm also going to equip Mega Quake. I think that'll make the Bombshell Build Blasters a lot easier to deal with. I don't think we need multi-bounce at this point. Mega Quake's going to do a ton of damage. I'm not fighting that Magikoopa because there are four of them in that battle, and like two of them start transparent, and one of them starts electric. Don't want to deal with that. Alright. Actually, are they faster than they normally are? Uh oh. Okay, and they actually, they only deal 10 damage. That's still a ton, but. It's a bombshell. Bill, they got gold casings. Okay, they are not as scary as I was afraid they were going to be. I thought they were going to deal like 30 damage. Even with all of my attack boosts, it still only dealt one damage. Alright, bombshell bill blasters. Oh, sweet, yeah. Mega Quake is going to take them out. Or actually, no, wait. Mega Quake might just not take them out. Dog on it. That's it. Uh, actually, no. This is fine. This is fine. Because we've got our trusty sidekick, Watt. Yay! <laughs> I love killing people with the uncharged de default attack of Watt. It's very funny. Alright. Actually, this room is not going to be as tricky as I thought it was going to be. I didn't know, though. I thought for sure the bombshell bills were going to deal a lot more damage. No, this is actually going to turn out to be slightly easier than the bullet bill blasters in Koopa Bros. Fortress it gave me. Because those killed me a couple of times. Granted, I was also a much lower level at that point, and was still getting used to the ins and outs of pro mode. Alright. Ah! What are you doing up here? I don't like this, Sam I am. We are going to get rid of these guys and make the Magikoopa run away. Run away, Magikoopa. Yeah, like the coward you are. Ooh, I think we'll level up from the, s the set of Bombshell Bill Blasters. Alright. Oh wait, that was... No, it wasn't a mistake. Good. Alright, we're gonna... Whoop! <laughs> we still have Cooper out. Not the ideal party member to use in this situation. Take out the Koopa Troll so he can't attack. Bombshell Bill Blaster's no biggie. Zap. Level up time? Yes! Excellent. Let's get some FP. I probably should have gone for HP, but... Nah. Nah.
Oh, this is why I equip... No, it's fine. And Magic Koopa runs away. <laughs> One star point. What challenges will we face today? Well, a lot, because Bowser's Castle is filled with challenges. We're going to have to fight Junior Troopa. We might even... I'm not optimistic that we're going to make it to the end of the game tonight, but we might. I'd be willing to stream for longer than usual if we if not getting to the end of the stream tonight. Or, the end of the game. Ooh, Super Shroom. Um, we're going to throw away the pebble, but... Oh, wait. I want the pebble. For the memes. I want, I want to finish off Bowser with the pebble. <laughs> it would be so funny if we could make it happen. Whoops! Did not mean to attack the Magic Koopa, but I guess this is what's happening. Hmm. Another Mega Quick. Hey, Vince! How you doing? Nice to see you. Also, welcome, Mobius. <laughs> it's a Mario stream. We're in the heart of Bowser's Castle right now. Don't, don't mind us. <laughs> Mario's streaming tonight. I am Mario. For all intents and purposes right now, I am Mario. <laughs> Let's go! All right, this room, yes. Oh my gosh, I hammered his bone out of the sky. I didn't know you could do that. This is actually one... These are some enemies that Bombette might be useful against in Pro Mode. Alright, how much HP do these guys have? Just... Oh, sweet. Mega Quake just obliterates these guys. I mean, I'm a little low on FP, but... <laughs> Beggars can't be choosers. I didn't know you could knock their bones out of the sky. Ouch. You won Backyard Baseball 2003 World Series. Nice. Congrats, Vince. Very exciting. Oh, wait. Why do I not have any Flower Saver badges equipped? No wonder I'm... No wonder I'm eating for my FP supply. Oh, this will not do. Okay. What does this have? A Super Shroom I kind of wanted. Oh, wait. I have the big cookie. Okay. We're gonna eat a cookie to get some FP back. Are you guys ready? Are you guys ready for Pro Strats by Artie? All right. So we ate a cookie, <laughs> got our FP back. Now we're gonna do a little bit of badge finagling. All right. So what are we not using? We're using all the Power Plus badges. We don't need Spike Shield if we're using this. We also don't need Zap Tap. Wonderful. So we're gonna equip Flower Finder which is going to help us get more flowers after defeating enemies. We're also going to unequip... or we're going to... let's see... Want equip one of our damage dodges to get Flower Fanatic, and that'll... yes, I like this. So now we should get more FP back after defeating enemies, and our Mega Quake should cost two less FP to use. <laughs> pro strats. It is pro mode, after all. So it's time to break out the smart ideas. Hi there, Bony Beetle. Well, I ate my cookie for nothing. It's okay. It still tasted good. Oh my gosh, a save block! A rarity among rarities. Hi, Bony Beetle. We can kill them all. I'm sorry. Knock them all out. Nobody dies in this game. Now. Okay. Drybones is technically not dead, which means Magikoop is not running away. All right, well. Did you guys know that you can use Starbeam on normal enemies? 
And it gets rid of their status enhancements, so no more transparent magic Koopa. How wonderful. You won 29 to 0 against the pirates in the final game and you were undefeated? Wow. Congrats, Vince. That's so cool. <laughs> That's insane! You got 29 points in one game. Oh no, plus free defense. Luckily, I don't think that affects Mega Quake, because it pierces defense. Beautiful. <laughs> Slap. Wow, Magic Oopas give way more star points than your average, Joe. Flower Finder gave one extra flower. Thanks. <laughs> yeah, Nintendo Addict Mega Quake is um, a little busted against common enemies. I'm just glad they didn't nerf it in this game. Ah, okay, Hammer Bros. Hammer Bros are going to be a little trickier. Because they have so much HP. Alright, hmm... Whatever they're about to do, I don't want to be around for it. <laughs> they didn't throw multiple hammers. That's strange. Well, <laughs> they're still gonna die. Hammer Bro 2 did not die. He didn't shrink me, though. That's good. Alright, well, let's take out the Hammer Bro first. Because I don't like his super attack. Goodbye. You got 12 runs in the first inning and went through all nine players in one inning. <laughs> Going for your whole batting lineup in a single inning is always really fun. Okay, seriously? Uh, flower? Flower Finder is not giving me nearly as many flowers as I was expecting. Oh, that's right. <laughs> I like this puzzle. You cover up this doorway, and shazam! Secret doorway. How oh, lovely, a castle key. I thought there was an ultra shroom in this area somewhere. Perhaps I was mistaken. Oh, wait, no, no, no. I know there's an Ultra Shroom and a, I think a Jam and Jelly in... Okay. Folks, I'm gonna attempt the Anti-Trio. I'm going to attempt it. I'm almost certainly going to fail, but... I gotta at least try. Alright. Yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna want Mega Quake. Yeah. And we're definitely going to want Bo as our party member. <laughs> no question. Alright. I'm going to attempt the anti-trio probably once. I'm almost certainly not going to beat them, and then I'm just going to go for it normally. Grow! Who would have thought you could make it this far? You won't make it any farther, because unfortunately for you, I won't let you pass. Grow! <laughs> but... 
I guess if you really want, I'll give you one chance. Because I know there's no way you'll make it anyway. Want to give it a shot? Yes. <laughs> this is completely pointless, but I suppose I'll let you try. Because of course I have such a kind and generous heart. Just joking, worm. <laughs> now, Mario, do you want to know what I've got in store for you? Yes. Now for a little quiz. Several of my followers will come out here. Your job is to carefully keep track of their numbers and colors. Then you'll have to answer my questions correctly. Quite frankly, we both know that this is impossible, but if you get five questions right, I'll let you go through here. You're allowed only two mistakes, though. <laughs> Fool that you are, you'll likely make three mistakes and suffer the dire consequences. Let's get going. I bet they changed this for promo. Alright, we got two, or three Dark Koopas and then four Goombas. Time's up! The most horrible nightmare quizzes. Now, tell me, how many Koopas were there? There were three of them. Oh wait, no, I'm trying- I'm getting them wrong on purpose. <sighs> you're right! That question must have been way too easy! Now they'll be harder. Next question. I forgot, I'm supposed to get them wrong. Three greens, four blues, and four- or three reds, four blues, and four greens. Do -do 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 -do. Now, which were there three of? A uh, green! <laughs> Grrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
Oh wait, I'm out of FP. Why am I out of FP? That's bad. <laughs> and the crowd is going wild. Well, this just got a lot more difficult. I knew I was going to fail at this, but... Oh, nope. I'm out of life streams. I did use a lot of Mega Quakes. Alright, well, I knew I was going to lose that one. Alright. Well... Did I not have Flower Fanatic equipped? Oh, I unequipped Flower Fanatic. Well, shoot. I sh huh. If I had another life... Nah. I'm not gonna try it again. I tried and I failed. Alright. Now we do the quiz for realsies. Do you want to give it a shot? No. I see! Not up to it. That's a smart choice. Because you and I both know you wouldn't be up to my challenge. Now just be a good little boy and run along now. Huh? Why are you still here? Did you change your mind? Have you decided to stop being a baby and challenge me? Yes. <laughs> it's completely pointless. Do you want to know what I've got to store for you? No. Okay, smart guy. Let's get going. <laughs> Do, 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 do. Time's up. How many Koopas were there? There were three of them. Oh, three or four. Uh, you're right. That question must have been way too easy. Now they'll be harder. Next question. Time's up! Alright, Worb. How many were there free of? There were free red Shy Guys. Gah, you're right! That question must have been way too easy, now they'll be harder. But they actually really won't. Okay, the red Shy Guys came out of the middle. Time's up! Okay, so they actually didn't change this. Who came out of the middle? The red Shy Guys. They are the answer to everything. Uh, you're right! The question must have been way too easy, and now they'll be harder. <laughs> There's one Goomba, one green... No, there are two Goombas, one green, and three blue, and then four Koopa. That's right, there were two Goombas. I remember this. I have a memory. How many Goombas were there? There were two of them. Uh, right answer. Ah, I can't believe you got four questions right! Alright, enough of this. I'm gonna quit messing around and ask you a really hard one. Next question. Goomba out of the left. Koop out of the middle. Dark Koop out of the middle. Time's up! The worst way of being a villain is always telling the hero your plans. Yep. <laughs> now, how many arms did you see just now? There were four. Goombas don't have arms. They don't need them. <laughs> Correct! I can't believe it! You got five of my super duper brain busters right! <laughs> I've been defeated by Mario! Oh, the shame! Yep, and now I get to open your face. Stop giving me super shrooms! I don't want them. Maple syrup I will take over a super shroom. I don't want a bobber of Koopa Trolls. Any I will happily take a jam and jelly, though. Alright, I have two life shrooms. Yeah. I'd rather have FP replenishing items than HP replenishing items. With all the Mega Quakes I go through and whatnot. 
All right, I guess I'm fighting. Guess I'm fighting the emulator. <laughs> I didn't save after the quiz. I have to do the quiz again. <laughs> I have to do the quiz again. Wow. Okay. Do 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 do. Is this the game telling me that they really want me to beat the anti trio? I'm trying to think. If the anti trio have 40 HP apiece, then six Mega Quakes will be enough to finish them off. I'm not fighting the anti trio. <laughs> it's not happening. <laughs> So, well, <laughs> we're just going through these questions again, so how's everyone doing tonight? <laughs> I want to hear, what's everybody's favorite fast food place? Mine is Chick-fil-A, followed by Culver's. They're both very good. How many Koopas were there? Wait, no, there were only three, weren't there? <laughs> when Artie talks to fast food, he forgets how to answer questions. I guess this means we get to see an extra question that we didn't see in the last time. Burger Bar. Is that a regional chain? I haven't heard of that one. Do do boo do boo do boo do boo do. All right, next question. It's also red shy guys. One fast food place that everybody seems to love that I cannot stand is Taco Bell. Like, that's not Mexican food. <laughs> you get what you pay for at Taco Bell. Like, if you like Taco Bell, then gr good for you. I'm, I'm happy for you. I personally just can't stand it, though. <laughs> I have no use for Taco Bell. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. Like, I love Mexican food, but I'm in Michigan, and we, um, we really don't have good Mexican restaurants here. At all. So, I, if I want good Mexican food, I have to make it myself. Which I'm happy to do. I have some good Mexican recipes. And if, if, I, and if I'm going to a restaurant to get Mexican food, I'm not going to a fast food place. Like, it's just not happening. It's like I wouldn't get sushi at a fast food place, either. Alright, I actually have to pay attention to this one, because I haven't seen this one yet. Alright, two red shy guys, one green shy guy, three bob -ombs, and four koopas. There were three... Oh, come on, I literally just saw this. There were three bob -ombs. No, oh, you got my brain busters right. All right, just in case it it, la it crashes again, we're going to save. Save early, save often. True in life and when playing uh, when playing emulated games. Burger bar is more of a restaurant or bar. Oh, nice. Oh, don't don't hurt me, Koopa Patrol. I wonder if there were like too many sprites on screen or something. Cause I'd fr thrown a bunch of items on the ground, and the Magic Koopas were sh launching spells at me. So maybe that had something to do with it. Wait, what am I doing? It's a save block. Of course I'm gonna use it. Oh, I love this. Mu I love this part of the Bowser's Castle music. And we're now, we're now at basically the end of the dungeon. Only a little bit more to go. Oh, hey. Uh, do I have Spike Shield equipped anymore? I do not, do I? Did I re-equip Flower Fanatic, though? Yes, okay. Oh, 
Oh, hi, you're, you're all by yourself. Bowser only wanted one guard at the prison. Slap a you face. There's an Italian restaurant near my place that one of the alcoholic beverages on the menu is literally called the Slap a you face. And it's like, it's really strong. It's got like all these different alcoholics in it. I don't, I don't get it myself, but I thought the name was hilarious. Yes, I would like to sleep in the jail cell. Devil Dogs is the fast food place you like best so far. That is another one I have not heard of. I, I take it that they sell hot dogs. Mario! Good work finding us! Thanks for coming! I can't believe I was captured so easily! How shameful! But Princess Peach is being held under heavy security! Please save her! Oh, Mario! Thanks for coming! It's so good to see you! All the prisoners got split up, so it's just been us four! All the others are safe? Please don't say we're the only ones you saved! I hope this whole horrible mess will be over soon so we can have a reunion with everybody! If I'd known this was going to happen, I would have gone home with Mayor Penguin! I wish I'd wake up in Shiver City and never have to leave again. <laughs> oh, I dream of sweet shaved ice treats every single day. Aw, I'm sorry, buddy. Shaved ice is pretty good. Even though it's literally just snow with syrup in it. Actually, I guess that's more snow cones. I love how the Bowser's Castle music gets progressively more epic as you go through it. Oh, uh, this is a fun puzzle. Thanks, Bombette. Ooh, Ultra Shroom, yes, please. Um. Sorry, Maple Syrup. I'm keeping the pebble. I'm keeping it. It's the rarest item in the entire game. There's literally only one of them in the entire game. If there is a way to get more than one pebble, please let me know. But as far as I can tell, it's a one of a kind item in Shiver Mountain. Oh no! I thought it was the top door that was locked. Yeah, I'm officially just dodging all the enemies. I don't care. <laughs> there we go. Castle Key. I've heard, I've heard of uh, the restaurant Al Cheval. I've heard that was voted like one of the best burgers like in the United States. I've also heard that they put eggs on basically everything. Okay. Um. I really don't want to fight these guys. When you've got two Magikoopas and two Hamburgers, and the Magikoopas are both invincible. Yeah, I'm, that's a no from me. Alright, up, down, down, up, down, up. I don't know how Bowser makes these endless hallways, but he's doing something right. I think this is kind of like the final stretch of enemies. Oh, uh, yep. Yep. Here we are. Oh, yeah. This is a fun part. Hey, Peach! Oh, Mario. You came to rescue me. Thank you so much. Oh, me? Oh, I just saw a chance to get away from Bowser and I ran. There's no need to fight him because I'm already safe. See? No need to fight! Let's hurry up and go home. I'll be right behind you. 
Okie dokie, princess! Let's go home! Wait, I thought, I thought she was right behind me! Oh, what? What's wrong, Mario? A suspicious guy? I... I didn't see anything. Maybe it was your imagination. Huh? You what? You want to save the people in the Peach's castle? Who cares about them? <laughs> Wait a second. You're not the real Princess Peach. Ouch! Oh, how could you? You're so cruel, Mario. Why do you want to hurt me? I'm going to tell King Bowser you're treating me like this. No! Oh, stop it! Please don't! Help me, King Bowser! I said cut it out! I know you weren't the real Peach. You you were sounding like a girl, not like the mobster. Ah, shoot! I wonder how you saw through my disguise. It was perfect. Well, I guess there's nothing I can do about it now. I'll just beat you up instead. Oh, okay. Let's starbeam away the transparency. That is so much nicer for pro mode. <laughs> that was really slow. Don't turn into a flying guy. Okay, bombet. That's annoying. Two bombets. Oh boy. Ooh, let's try Fire Shell. Let's turn up the heat! Ouch. Haha! <laughs> Takes out the bomb vets, because they're explosive. Apparently. The duple goats literally become explosive. <laughs> Defend Plus, baby! <laughs> wow, that was embarrassing. <laughs> Did you just feel a breeze, Cooper? I didn't feel anything. <laughs> Let's let the real bow take out fake bow. <laughs> that's how you slap somebody. <laughs> now that's how you make a banana split. Alright, now we just have Junior Trooper left, and we're at Bowser's Castle. Yeah, I f it looks like we'll actually be beating the game tonight. How exciting. Alright. Now we gotta prepare for Junior Trooper. Mega Quake? No. Flower Fanatic? Don't need that either. We'll get P up, D down. Make it interesting. Spike Shield for sure. Zap Tap could be amusing. And I guess this is the last one, Jump Charge? It's probably not going to be that important, but you never know. Maybe a last stand would have been a better idea, but it's okay. <laughs> How in the world did you get this far in the castle? Congratulations. But this is the end of your adventure, I'm afraid. I've got much better defenses than the other guard doors do. Your luck has just run out. Come on, boys! Here come the Koopa Bros! I bet you never thought you'd see us again, huh, Mario? You do remember who we are, don't you? Heck yeah. Yeah, that's right! We were too cool to forget! A lasting impression, yeah! Now they're going to beat you within an inch of your life. Feel like running away, worm? Tell you what, if you beat them, you can go through here. Of course, you'll fail. But at least you can try. <laughs> Don't think we're like before. We've increased our power beyond our wildest dreams. After you trounced us, we learned a new technique and trained all day, every day. And we're not just the Koopa Bros. We're the super ultra-mighty Koopa Bros the Great. Check out our coolness. Huh? 
Wah! I found you, Mario! At last! You're mine! It was a pain finding you, you know! Today, at long last, I'll settle my score with you! I was kind of hoping we could fight the Koopa Bros, too, honestly. Here it comes, Mario! This is the final fight! Only one of us is walking away from this battle! Alright, well... Let's see if you have more HP this time, buddy. It's Junior Troopa again! My man! The little guy still has some eggshell left on his body! Aww! Whoa, he's been working out! It's as if he looks as if he might be able to change shape, too. You've gotta love this guy's effort, Mario. To follow us all the way here? What dedication! Come to think of it, how do you think he got here anyway? He flew, he has wings. Or he can he can have wings. Okay, little guy packs a punch. Oh wow. He has less HP than before. How embarrassing. Darn it! Okay, try this on for size! Ultimate power! Ouch! Alright, let's just kiss that away. <laughs> you can tell the game is lagging slightly because the music is a little laggy. Ow! That is really hard to action guard for some reason. And of course I threw away all of my... Mario needs another kiss! <laughs> you thought this sounded like the PAL music? Does the PAL version have slightly different songs? This is definitely slower than the Junior Troop of Theme is supposed to be. SHOOT! Okay, maybe something else! How about this?! That's... new? I've never seen that move before. If I use a life shroom, then I use a life shroom. A better idea. PAL version runs slower, so that includes the music. At least in quest inter- I didn't know that. That's very interesting. See, folks, when you come to Artie's streams, you learn new stuff. Ah! You've still got some skills! Well, I don't know the timing for action guarding that, because that's a new move he has. It's okay, I can cheat with a life shroom. It only cost me four coins. Or actually, it cost me eight coins in pro mode. Alright. Bombette! Get rid of this guy for good. Twenty six star points. Not bad. Darn it, darn it, darn it. Don't think you've won, Mario. I swear to you, I'm going to beat you so bad next time. Gosh. Uh, so since you beat the guy that beat the Koopa Bros. Does that mean that you beat the Koopa Bros? No, you beat him, he beat them, but you didn't actually lay a finger on- ah! It's too confusing! Okay, fine. I guess there was no big difference between that guy and the Koopa Bros. You can go through. It's not possible for you to beat King Bowser anyway. I'll let you have the honor of being per beaten personally by the evil King Bowser. Lucky you. Oh, thanks, buddy. Oh, and there's a life stream in Peach's Castle we can grab anyway, so that actually kind of works out alright. Alright. Bet this goes to Shooting Star Summit! Aha! I see. I see. I was wondering where that wood pipe would lead. That's really cool. 
All right, let's prep for the Bowser battle, because we're still going to... I bet you that's where we can go back now and do the bonus content. I bet you that's what it is. All right. Quick change for sure. Power plus, definitely. I'm not going to have P up D down. I think we're going to need some extra defense for this. No for Spike Shield. I will equip Fire Shield to protect us from the fire. Actually, that only is plus minus one damage. Actually, I guess it's minus two for pro mode. That's an option. I think Zap Tap's a good idea. I bet you he can inflict status effects on us. I bet you that's something he can do. Um, what else? D down jump. D down jump is a good choice. All right, and what else? So we can we can equip one last fin, last stand maybe. Out of all of these, I think last stand is probably for the best. Now we get the Creepy Peaches Castle music. Alright, first things first. We're gonna go to the library. I was about to say, where are all the guards in here? But Gar Bowser literally said that all guards had to leave and go to his castle to defend it. So that actually checks out. We also need to take a nap, and just in case Bowser's first form happens to be really difficult for some reason, we're gonna save again. Hey, dude! Nothing in here but clothes! Please don't open! Oh! Huh? Mario! Oh, sweet! You came to save me, right? Whew, I was so scared! Thanks for coming! While you're here, would you like to take a quick nap? I'll wake you if anyone bad comes in, I swear it! Would you like to take a nap? It's nice that Peach has this guest bed. Alright, well, I have a feeling Bowser's going to be a great and legitimately challenging fight. I don't think he's going to be nearly as difficult as he was in my level 0 run, though. So, I'm feeling pretty confident that we can beat him up. I bet you one change they're going to make, I bet you Bowser will be able to make himself invincible and attack in the same turn. Because in the, in the vanilla game, that was always just like a thing where it's like, oh, he turned invis invincible. I guess Mario uses his turn to make him not invincible, and then your party member can attack Bowser. <laughs> so it was literally like bad for Bowser whenever he made himself invincible. But even then, Bowser with double attack power and probably buffed HP is, pro is likely going to be a pretty challenging fight. Oh, Mario, help! <laughs> if it isn't my old pal Mario, I've been waiting for you. I'm amazed you managed to come this far. How lucky for me. You've been a distraction for far too long, little man. It'll be a pleasure to squash you personally, again. Mario! Fool! You can't beat me! I'm invincible! <laughs> can you beat promo of 10 HP only? Apparently, there's a 10 HP challenge you can do in this. <laughs> Alright, Mario. Let's see your so-called power. Let's give it to him. It's the Evil King Bowser! Finally, after all this time, he has a huge arsenal of attacks from blowing clouds of fire to jumping on us. Boy, does he look nasty. He's strong enough as is, but I'm sure he can use that Star Rod to increase his power until he's nearly invincible. Princess Peach needs us! Let's take him, Mario! Yeah, Bowser can't heal himself in his final form if your HP is, is at 25% of its maximum. Oh, wow. Okay, Bowser's first form got a little more HP, but not that by much. Once again, Watt is the best party member for bosses. Alright, enough of that! Now witness the power of this fully operational Star Rod! Does he always say that, or did they just change that? I do not remember him saying that in the vanilla game. <laughs> nope, he... 
still... He still is not attacking in the same turn. What the? Ow! What in the world was that? Uh, what happened to the power of that stupid star rod? Also, this Bowser theme is like the best Bowser theme ever. God, you cheap little coward! This fight's just beginning. I always underestimated D down jump, apparently. It is really crazy good. Okay, he healed himself. Oh no. Oh, sweet. <laughs> so long, King Bowser! Well, his first form enemies. Wow, that's a lot of star points. Oh man, we're six star points away from a level up! <laughs> Gosh, you're not bad! How'd you get so strong? Still, you're just an annoyance. That was like a warm up for me. No! Oh, leave me alone! Mario, help me! If you want to save Princess Peach, you would better follow me. Gotta save Fug Life Peach. So close to getting to 45 HP, I know. I'm not backtracking all the way to Bowser's Castle just to get some extra star points, though. We fight him as we are. Yes, I would like to save... I, f I think we need to tattle on him again. Oh, wait a second. That's right, no health block. I'm going to take a nap! <sighs> I know you get fully healed in the second phase of that fight, but... Is there a promo for Faust in your door as well? I believe there is, yes. I think there are multiple hacks of the game to make it a lot harder. I am not very interested in playing those, though. Even though I love Thousand in Your Door, the main reason is I really, really stink at doing the super guards in that. And I'm pretty sure that, like, all of the hard mode hacks are basically just like, oh, you need to super guard, like, literally everything. So that just, that does not appeal to me at all. <laughs> if you want to save Princess Peach, you better follow me. Okay, but I'm going to take a nap first. Can we wait? Oh, uh, yeah, okay, we can wait, Mario. <sighs> I'm okay with that. Yeah, I, I didn't like the Super Guard mechanic either, where it's just like, oh, yeah, you can literally just take no damage from an attack and deal one damage pierce to the enemy. Like, I get that the hardcore fans of the game, like, really like it, but the timing is so tight on it, and, like, if you have mastered it, then the game is just, like, not challenging at all. Because it's like, wow, I'm, like, literally invincible. Granted, that game is pretty broken when it comes to uh, game-breaking strategies. <coughs> Danger Mario. <laughs> it's still an amazing game, though, but I like the first Paper Mario more. I think it's only, like, a free-frame window for you to actually be able to super guard. I think the game runs at 30 FPS, so that's still, like, a tenth of a second, but that's not that much. And especially if I have to deal with, like, slight game lag or input delay... I really don't. I'm really not keen on doing that. Plus, my laptop can't run the Dolphin emulator all that well, so. You think it's 60 FPS? I know it's a free frame window, so then that's literally a 20th of a second. Alright. It's Bowser time! <laughs> Welcome to your nightmare! You should thank me, Mario. Since you've been my rival for so long, I've arranged a special arena for your defeat. 
But King Bowser, now we can't leave either. Shut up! <laughs> like it? You're completely trapped. How does it feel, huh? Mario, be careful. <laughs> you fell right into our trap, and you called yourself a hero. Did you think we were foolish enough to just sit back and watch as you saved the Star Spirits? I've put together a little surprise for you, a device that increases Bowser's power. King Bowser will be so powerful that not even the power of the Star Spirits can compare. He'll now truly be invincible, thanks to my wisdom. Are you ready, my king? Then power up! I like how Bowser and Cammy Koopa are genuinely, like, smart in this game. And don't just, like, sit on their butts and do nothing. Also, great sound effect right here. Whoa! Yes! Oh, Cammy Koopa! That was incredible! I feel like I'm exploding with power! Now I'll be able to squash this cheeky plumber! Hey you, Mario! It's not going to be like before, you mustached loser. Prepare to be beaten. Also, epic music time. <laughs> They're not smart enough to send their strongest minions to stop Mario at the game's start, but you know. Um, I seem to remember there was indeed a hammer bro in the first world. It's the evil kid Bowser! Uh, I think he got bigger! That's not a good sign! He has a huge arsenal of attacks for bowling cards to Joe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, wait, I forgot that. Kami Koopa's mysterious device has somehow beefed up his power even more. That's hardly fair. You should use that star beam whenever he uses the star rod to increase his power. Oh, you already knew that? Ouch, I'm still bad at action guarding that. Okay, so he got some slightly beefed HP. Not by a ton. But it should make for an interesting boss fight. <laughs> Time to increase my power with my good old Star Rod! Alrighty. Star Beam time! <laughs> you idiot! That weak attack doesn't affect me anymore! Oh no! We're in trouble! The star beam doesn't work! Ooh, that bad monster is gonna beat us up now for sure! <laughs> it is witchcraft. Oh no! Brave Mario! What can I do? The way things are going, Bowser will surely defeat him. Somebody, please help Mario! Why do you have to constantly run your mouth and stop talking like that? Keep quiet! Twink's back, y'all! Oh, Princess Peach, are you alright? I'll get you out of those ropes. Twink! Oh, I'm so glad you're okay! I think it's time to say goodbye to Fug Life Peach for the final battle. You insolent little star kid! How dare you! You little whippersnapper! You're too young to fight me! I... I... I'm not afraid of you! Oh, be careful, Twink! <laughs> Did I just feel a breeze? Was that really your attack? Focus. Oh, Twink. Really? You're making a regular hammer block? Not even, like, the ultra blocks. Free damage. I wonder if Kami is gonna be different in the pro mode, or if it's just the same scripted fight. <laughs> now! Why, you little! So you can fight a little! <laughs> I love this gimmick of Peach using the basic focus is, like, powering up Twink. It's so great. <laughs> Kami Koopa is significantly less threatening than your average Magic Koopa in this. Now, What's going on? Why does it seem like the Star Kid's getting stronger? I saw the numbers above my head increasing. <laughs> Power up!
Why can't we get Peach as a party member? Just She just focuses every turn. I wish we could get Luigi as a party member. That would be really great. It, it can't be! My attacks don't work! Oh, oh no! Now I remember! The stars get all of their power from ordinary people's wishes! Peach's wishes are giving that little star kid power! Yeah, they are. Hasta la vista, Cammy. No, oh, Keaton Bowser! I have failed you! Can we get Twink as a, as a party member? He could just keep getting more powerful every turn. Oh, yes! We did it, Twink! Jeez, that jump scares me every time! <laughs> now we must save Mario! But, what can I do? I know! Princess Peach, make a wish! Just like you did for me! Make a wish to give more power to the Star Spirits! Think of the Mushroom Kingdom, Star Haven, Mario! Make a wish to the stars, thinking of all those fiends! If your wish is strong enough, it'll reach the Star Spirits to give them strength! <laughs> a dream is a wish your heart makes! Okay, Twink, I'll try. I'll go help Mario! When you wish upon a star, Bowser's power doesn't go very far. <laughs> <laughs> What's the matter, Mario? Feeling a bit under the weather? You want to work out more? Oh my! I feel power flooding into me! I love those Disney songs! <laughs> Honorable Star Spirits, I'll do what I can to help. Twink? What a surprise! I feel the wishes of Princess Peach and all of the Mushroom Kingdom are giving us power. Perhaps now we can match Bowser's strength. Now, Mario, don't give up. Everyone's behind you. Receive our power and do your very best. Power up the Star Beam! Star Beam has been upgraded! It's now Peach Beam! Mario can now use Peach Beam. Wha what's going on? Mario, are you still standing? You should just give up. You'll never beat me. Well, actually, I got a new trick up my sleeve. It's the same as before, but now Twink is in the middle, which means it's better. <laughs> Me. My star rod power's gone! Oh, folks, you know what we need to use that we haven't used at all? Cloud Nine! Cloud Nine is really good. <laughs> Chances of being attacked will decrease. Boom. <laughs> oh man, I love this final boss music. Granted, Bowser can destroy Cloud-9 with one of his Star Rod's moves. But there's a chance Cloud-9 will dodge it! I also learned- yeah, so two things I've learned about Bowser's healing moves since my level 0 playthrough. One... <laughs> one, he can't heal himself if your HP is at 25% of your max or less. And two, he can't heal himself more than three times in a given battle. So if you keep it up, he will eventually die. That electric guitar, though. Alright, so he, he should only be able to heal himself one more time. Alright, Cloud9 has worn off. What a shame. Oh, whatever will we do? Oh wait, we can just give it to him again. Oh wait, I should have used Cloud-9 against the Anti-Trio. Actually, no, Out of Sight is way better. Alright, he's still not attacking after making himself invincible. That would make Bowser significantly scarier. <laughs> Alright, no, this, this doesn't even seem like it's going to be that difficult. It's okay, the true final boss is going to be the final master fight.
Alright, he should not be able to heal himself anymore. I literally haven't taken damage this fight yet. At least after the... <laughs> after his first phase. Alright. Let's get ready for a real fight. Yep! Yeah, that would normally take away Cloud9, except Cloud9 caused me to just avoid that attack. <laughs> yeah, he, yeah. if he attacks you while he's in quote-unquote invincible, he gets like plus 10 attack power or something. Oh my gosh, Cloud9 is literally just letting me dodge everything. It's only supposed to be around a 50% chance, but we've gotten lucky. Keep it up, Black Lester. <laughs> they say Lack of Lester is a bad party member. He is pretty bad. But this move this move is basically his only good move. I might have to chug a jar of jelly in this fight. You think Bowser has another trick later? Oh interesting. I kinda hope so. I want this fight to be a challenge. It is the final boss fight, after all. Oh my- what the heck is up with this Cloud9? It- <laughs> it should not be working this much. This battle's not over yet! Okay, there we go. I there we go. I've been waiting for that. Wow, I actually action guarded that. All right. Well, we do need to heal ourselves. Cloud Nine's effect has worn off. Well, folks, I think we need it to treat ourselves to a feast. Wow, Cloud9 is busted! I forgot how good this move is. Why haven't I been using it before now? <laughs> yeah, this is significantly easier than vanilla level 0 Bowser. Like, significantly. <laughs> It's not even a competition. Let's let some of our other party members shine for a bit. Ah, water in my eye! Wait, that's literally just Electro Dash, but it takes FP. Okay. I was wondering when that was going to happen. Ooh, wait. Yes, 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 yes! <laughs> Come on, Bowser. I just need you to claw me or jump on me one more time. Let's use Water Block. Thanks, Sushi. Plus one defense. Nope. Bowser's gonna make fiends a little difficult. Will the pebble tank, though? I don't think so. I think pebble might pierce defense. I know it doesn't tank in the vanilla game. Because when I actually did a let's play of the vanilla game, I finished the battle by throwing the pebble at him. Oh, actually... <laughs> What's your air carrying him away? <laughs> Surprisingly, Paracarry was unable to carry King Bowser away. Alright. <laughs> uh, Cooper, you've been the MVP for this, so we're going to have you finish him off. Alright. So long, gay Bowser! Bowser! <laughs> 
beaten by a pebble, the humanity. Oh no! Mario defeated me! Again! With the pebble! Again! He always defeats me! This time I became invincible, and I still couldn't beat him! Darn it! Okay. That was fun. Bowser was still quite easy, but also that fight was massively made easier by Cloud9 giving some really good luck. You took back the Star Rod! Oh, Mario! Mario, I knew you would save me. Thank you, Mario. Bowser got up remarkably quickly. What? Huh? I'm awake! Huh? What's going on? This isn't a part of my plan! Yo, Kami Koopa, uh, what's with all the shaking? Ah, uh, your kingship, the Battle of Mario was so intense that my device for increasing your power seems to have started malfunctioning. Ah, uh, it's entirely screwed up and its power appears to be heading back into your castle. I hate to tell you this, but both your castle and this spot right here are about to explode. We must flee, my evil kid! We have no choice! What? Are you... Really? That's... a big problem. Uh, let's get out of here right... Huh? You gotta love how only Bowser's castle was blowing up, and not Peach's castle. Even though Peach's castle was, castle was closer to that platform than Bowser's. That new trick Bowser has, guess you'll have to explore the post-game. Oh yeah, I, I'm i gonna need at least one, maybe, probably two streams for the post-game. Especially if I'm trying to get all the star pieces. That sounded like Zelda's lullaby for a bit there. Don't worry, the stars save us. Take the star rod back. Oh, thank you. Now we can be really cheap in Smash Bros. Oh, Mario, thank you. You did it. You brought back our precious star rod. I thank you from the bottom of my heart. We will use it to bring peace back to this world. I want to see the Star Spirits return in another Mario game, other than Mario Party 5. Now we'll be able to grant everyone's wishes again. All of this is thanks to you, Mario. When you look at the night sky, you'll know that the glittering stars are praising you for your courage. Look upon their bright light and remember our thanks. You really took it to Bowser, Mario! Really socked it to him! What impressive strength! I knew you could do it! Mario, don't think that we don't know how hard you've worked for all of us. It must have been difficult. This was pro mode, after all. We won't forget your efforts. I hope Bowser learns something from all this. Maybe he'll behave himself now. Although I'd say the chances of that are pretty, pretty slim. Ah, well. No words can express completely how thankful we are for all you've done. Hope has returned both to the Star Haven and all of the Mushroom Kingdom. We are in your debt, Mario. And Twink, may I say, you really rose to the occasion. You've proven yourself to be a grown-up star. <laughs> Aw, go on! In the next, if the Star Spirits reappear, I want Twink to be a Star Spirit. Well, I think it's time we return to Star Haven. All of the stars are waiting for us there, no doubt. It's time to say goodbye for now, Mario. May the stars forever shine brightly upon you. I just realized, like, most of the Star Spirits in this game really sucked. And for terms of their power. Like, Refresh carried us in the early game. Uh, Smooch carried us in the end of the game. <laughs> We never used up and away. Lullaby never worked. Timeout never worked. Uh, chill out wasn't that great, and Star Storm got nerfed to uh, heck and back. Mario, I'd like to thank you too. And Princess Peach, it was an honor to help you in your time of need. I hope maybe to see you again sometime. For now, I'm going to become a respectable star and make people's wishes come true. Thank you so much for helping me, Twink. You've always been a stellar friend to me. Ha <laughs> ha. Princess Peach, I. I... 
Well, no, never mind. I have to go too. But uh, when you play N64 Rainbow Road in Mario Kart, uh, that I'm the star that's there. Thank you very much, Mario. I'll always remember you, Princess Peach. Goodbye. Yay! Ah, oh, what a magical game. Truly a magical game. Like, this game has some of, like, the most charm, I'd say, out of any video game I've played. I, I just love it so much. And I'm really glad that people are actually making mods for it. It's great. There's apparently a tougher version of Pro Mode called Paper Mario Master Quest, which I am probably not going to play. If I do, it certainly won't be for a while. Oh, so that's it, huh? That's how you took the Star Rod back from Bowser. It seems like another wild adventure is in the books, bro. The castle's back in its normal place and everyone's returned home safely. You came through in the end, just like you always do. I know you've been back for days now, but I bet you still kind of feel like you're on an adventure, don't you? That reminds me, the pals who traveled with you. I wonder what they're up to now. Well, Mario's playing tag with his sister. Goombario! Hey, Paracarry! What's up? I thought you were back at work delivering letters. Ha ha ha! I sure am! This isn't a social call. I dropped by to bring a letter to you, Goombario. It's from Princess Peach. I can never unsee Paracarry. I, I swear, every time I look at him, I'm just like, he has Princess Leia hair, even though he's wearing, like, a, a hat. Whoa! For Princess Peach? Whoa! What's she writing to be for? Read it and find out. I don't read people's personal letters like Luigi does. I've got to deliver more letters. Thanks, Paracarry. See ya. Keep working hard, buddy. Take care. Hey, Goombario. What did Princess Peach write in her letter? Let me see. Hey, on, Goombaria. Jeepers! This is an invitation to a party at the castle. It says the princess is having a party and I'm invited to go have fun. Whoa, whoa, whoa! Party at the castle is always interesting. Hey, Bombette, uh, I got a letter for you. Better not be for my stalker. It's not. Oh, could you deliver this for me, Paracarry? Lady Boo. <laughs> Lady Bo, I stole this from Paracarry. <laughs> Look at it. Ha ha ha, we're going to have fun tonight, Bootler. Yeah, so, uh, party at Peach's house. We're gonna crash. <laughs> Actually, you don't get to crash, because I got an invitation. Oh, okay. Hey everyone, I know this letter's only inviting me, but I'm inviting all of you as my plus ones! <laughs> oh boy! <laughs> hey, uh, Lackluster, uh, only you got the invite. Peach doesn't know who your girlfriend is. Can I bring her as a plus one? No, Sushi already took all the plus ones. Doggone it! Now then, gentlemen, it's time to scale the frosty heights to the Crystal Palace. Cooper, old boy, you're in charge of guiding us. Your prior experience is terribly important to the success of our expedition. Yeah, leave it to me. I know the place front to back. Cooper! Huh? Paracarry, what brings you here? Whew, I finally made it. I have a letter to you from Princess Peach. Oh, oh wow! This is an invitation to a huge party at Princess Peach's castle! It's directly from the princess herself! It's even got her signature on it and everything! Cool! Oh, there's no way I can miss a bash this big, but... But I can't just turn my back on this expedition after I promised Professor Colorado. I should stay here and... Oh, poppycock! Balderdash! Don't be daft, dear boy! Turning down such an invitation would be terribly impolite! This is a golden opportunity! Go to the party this instant! Don't spare me another thought! It would ruin the party if the hero of Koopa Village, nay, the hero of the Mushroom Kingdom, wasn't even there. Normally he's speaking facetiously, but Cooper legit was kind of like the savior of the pro mode. Like, he, his power show was just ridiculously good. Huh? I knew you'd say that, Professor Colorado. You're so kind and generous. I'll do it. I hope you guys will be alright without me. I'm gonna party! Yahoo! Look at me now, Mom! <laughs> oh, Colorado, I have a message for you as well. Don't bother coming back home, you wandering buffoon! What a good and no good husband. That was a message for your from your wife. Colorado, you set out on this expedition without telling your wife again, didn't you? 
boy, was she so furious. Oh, good gracious! p p p p p p p Why in the world didn't you tell me this first? This is a crisis, old boy! I must away back home with all due speed! Well, uh, guess there's not much point in going Crystal Palace ourselves. Wanna get some hot chocolate? Sure, bro. <laughs> huh? Did you hear something outside? I think I did. I'll go take a quick look. Hey, bro, guess what? Barrett Gary stopped by to drop off a party invitation from Princess Peach. He said that he's also invited to the party, so he took off and said he'd see us at the castle when we arrived. Now we'd better go, too. Oh, boy. <laughs> and we got the classic old music. Awesome. Okay, listen Mario, I'm just gonna run ahead. There's something important that I have to do. What is it? <laughs> Sorry bro, it's top secret. I feel like my Luigi voice is not as good as I thought it was going to be. <laughs> I can do Waluigi really great. <laughs> but Luigi, not so much. For those of you who don't know, you absolutely should come back here. Okay, first off, I'm missing one tasty recipe. I don't know what it is. Oh boy. I'll have to go for all the recipes again. Definitely read Luigi's private diary in the epilogue. Oh wow, I forgot to read it after um, chapter 7. Somebody said to me that a way will open when you use a scarf and bucket. What? A scarf or a snowman? Wouldn't it melt him? Yesterday I got stuck in the trap door when I was entering my secret room. Have I been using it too much, or am I putting on weight? I'd better oil it to make it open easier. When I looked up at the sky tonight, I saw, a, I saw a shooting star arcing across the sky towards Princess Peach's castle. I made a wish to the stars right away, but I wonder if it'll really be granted. What I wished was... I can't write it even though this is a secret diary. Nah, you can still see it even though I erased it! My wish is to sleep in the top bunk bed. <laughs> that could probably be arranged. I heard that my brother finally saved Princess Peach. Bowser increased his power of the star rod, but my brilliant brother beat him anyway. I guess he'll be coming back home pretty soon. I'm looking forward to listening to the story of his adventure. Anyway, I'm going to finish this diary for now. I have to seal this room off before he notices that I remodeled without telling him. Now I'm going to go prepare a dinner to celebrate Mario's return, Luigi. Aw, that's nice of him. Didn't get the seal of concrete, though. Dear Mario, how are you holding up? It's so sunny in flower fields, peace has returned here. Lily's in her own little world, as usual. Rosie is spreading a rumor that you're interested in her. Ah, it's not true! I heard that Petunia's singing your praises across the land. As you know, I can't move from this spot, but I'm content to watch the Boboops frolic. Good luck to you, Mario. All the flower fields is wishing to the stars that your dreams will come true, the wise wister would. What recipe am I Oh, do I still have to just make cake? I might still have to just make regular old cake. I actually think that's what it is. Hey, everybody. Sorry, but... Oh, I'll talk to you, though. Kawiz! It's your old pal Chuck Kawizmo! How'd you like to take part in the quiz game? <laughs> nah, just kidding. Just enjoy the party. Yeah. We gotta go to the party. We're going overtime for this stream anyways. But it's okay. Aw, everybody's here. It's just like Smash Ultimate. Where are you going, Mario? Princess Peach awaits you in the castle! Oh, I was going to go exchange star pieces for badges, but okay. No, I'm not talking to any of you. Mario, welcome to the castle! Princess Peach should be here very shortly. And now, Princess Peach! In the flesh. Or I guess, in the paper. Greetings to all of you! I'm so glad everyone could be here on this special day. The Star Rod stolen by Bowser has returned to its rightful place in Starhaven. Peace has once again returned to the Mushroom Kingdom. Above us, the stars shine with more beauty and power than ever before. It seems that they're sending us their thanks. Mario, Goombario, Cooper, I guess Bombette even though you got nerfed, Paracarry, Bo, Watt, Sushi, Lackalester. 
and everybody across the lands of the Mushroom Kingdom. We've regained peace because of all your efforts. Thank you very much indeed. I appreciate it from the bottom of my heart. I hope that the Mushroom Kingdom will enjoy peace and prosperity for a long time to come, perhaps forever. This is my heartfelt wish. So, let's celebrate! Enjoy the festivities, everyone! Yeah! Best princess ever! Thank you, Peach! <laughs> and now, we get to treated to the greatest credit sequence in all of video games. Or just in all of media. <laughs> Luigi gets to lead the parade that's being honored just for us for beating the game. It has, like, every character in the game and an like, amazing medley of basically all the songs in the game. It's fantastic. I wish more games put effort into their credits. Star Rod Modding Tools. Clover. Thank you, Clover. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, all our party members are in the famous bathtub. I love how Cooper's waving to everybody. Or is he the one throwing the confetti? Oh no, Paracarry's throwing the confetti. Obviously. <laughs> Cooper's just eyeing the, the female toads behind him. <laughs> Still have a couple of your quizzes left, Kawizmo. Oh yeah, it's the Koopa Bros. And the Bob-Oms, they're like, hey bros, up? <laughs> Colorado made up with his wife, and now they're both riding a tuna. Love that little remix of Dry Dry Outpost. Yeah, so there's apparently a good bit of post-game content in this mod, so I'll have to be covering some of that in Wednesday's stream. I might end up needing another stream for it. Nom, 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 nom. So I think my plan is I'm going to do as much as I can on Wednesday at the usual stream time of 8 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. If I can't get through all of it, then I'll do a special Friday stream where I finish the rest of it up. Because we should be very close to just 100%ing this. Hey, Tubba Blabba. <laughs> Goomba Tree. Goomba King has been stuck in that tree for a while. I'll buy Yoshi's! Can we have a real life parade like this? This would be great. <laughs> Yoshi! <laughs> the lava piranha looks like a dog. <laughs> Lava Piranha is still my favorite boss. <laughs> hey Yoshi kids, <laughs> you want to eat Huff and Puff? I'm sure he tastes good. It's like cotton candy. Except cotton candy is um kind of terrible, honestly. He's like, wait, you can eat that? I didn't know you could eat that. Hey, come back. I want to try. Crystal Kane has one of the coolest designs. No pun intended. <laughs> I also love the Duple Ghosts. The Duple Ghosts are such cool characters.
<laughs> Junior Troop has finally found a sparring buddy! <laughs> was Bowser invited to join in the parade, or is he crashing? <laughs> He's like, he doesn't look very happy to be in the parade. He looks less happy now. And that's why we don't see Junior Troopa in any future games. And now it turns into the Main Street Electrical Parade. Which is a cooler part of the parade. <laughs> the penguins on ice! <laughs> Oh, it's my favorite part of the song coming up next. <laughs> that little choir with all the Merlin guys is amazing. I love how the wise Wisterwood is neon has neon lights, and I love how the sun is in the nighttime part of the parade. <laughs> Special thanks to the Super Mario Club. Well, why would you not give special thanks to it? And ladies and gentlemen, we bring you... Disco Guy. This little guy's got the moves. Boom, boom, ba -loom, boom, boom, ba -loom, ba -loom, boom, 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 boom. Oh, that poor little shy guy always trips. He tripped so many times in my playthrough because I had to redo General Guy so many times. Whoa! The toads have neon hel helmets. How do you get how do you get your heads to do that? Oh boy, I don't know how I got invited onto this part of the parade. <laughs> Luigi leads and I end it. Hey Twink, nice to see you again. I'd be cool if seeing Twink in another Mario game. Maybe give him a little more personality, though. <laughs> 2001. It was a good year. Oh, that was the same year my sister was born. Off to Peach's Castle. Ah, what a magical game. I never get tired of playing it. It's so good. And man, what a great hack. Pro Mode was definitely a lot of fun to play. There were very few complaints, honestly, with it. I saw that, Peach! I don't think I've ever seen that before. That was really cute. I don't think I've ever noticed that Peach kisses Mario here before. That was adorable. Aww. Yeah, very few complaints of Pro Mode. Most of it was just they nerfed stuff that should not have been nerfed, like Bomb... I didn't... Like, Bombette's stuff already got nerfed by making it cost more FP, which I was okay with, but they also made it way less powerful. And, like, Starstorm was a lot worse. Whatever. Very few complaints, though. It was very, very fun, and it was the right level of difficulty, I'd say. It wasn't too difficult. Alright, that's it for today's stream, everybody. It went a little over time. You got a little extra because I wanted to finish off the game. Tune in for Wednesday's stream. We'll be covering some of that post-game content. Maybe we can do it all? Probably not. But if we can, then hunky-dory. Otherwise, we'll use a Friday in order to finish everything off. So, thanks for tuning in, everybody. I hope you have a great rest of your night, and God bless.